It's Jeffrey Dahmer, the serial killer and cannibal whose saga of evil has been given new life in the hit Netflix series, Monster. I'm gonna ask you some questions that are tough. In this never before seen video from the Inside Edition archives, he's clearly nervous. His hands won't stay still as he prepares for the exclusive 1993 interview. What questions are you gonna start out with? A new generation is learning about his horrifying crimes through the number one Netflix series. In what appears to be a psychopathic mass murder. Destination 32 clear. This world exclusive interview took place inside the maximum security prison in Wisconsin where he was serving 999 years. He was escorted by three prison guards. One officer held each arm as he was taken in handcuffs into an elevator. Nobody was taking any chances with the most notorious killer in America. Dahmer was 33 when he told Nancy Glass about his twisted motive for killing 17 men. Not because I was angry with them, not because I hated them, but because I wanted to keep them with me. And uh, as my obsession grew, uh, I was saving body parts such as uh, skulls and uh, skeletons and eventually I did uh, turn to uh, cannibalism. For you. He described how he picked up his victims in gay bars and brought them home. I'd have the uh, sleeping pill mixture already prepared. Person would drink it, fall asleep and uh, that's when they would be strangled and he made a startling admission about the evil urges that propelled him to kill. Do you still feel those same urges? Do you still feel that compulsion, that obsession? Uh, I wish I could say that uh, it just left completely, but uh, no, there are times when I still do, still do have uh, the old compulsions. A creature of the night, he said he slept most of the day in prison. During the interview, he was, asked for uh, several breaks. Can we cut the film here for a minute? Sure. Dahmer was murdered by another prison inmate just a year and 10 months after this interview. A form of justice he said he deserved. That's what I deserve. I deserve death.